And this wicked weather has forced airlines to cancel or delay thousands of flights across the country on this busy travel weekend. Eyewitness News reporter Dan Krauth is live at LaGuardia Airport. Dan. Lauren, delays have picked up here since I saw you last, and everyone is just trying to get home. That's why we're seeing so much yellow here on the board. I just counted about three dozen delays and a few cancellations. That weather affecting both incoming and outgoing flights. But if you take a look here at the ticket counter, there aren't any lines. Things are running smoothly, so that's good news. But with a storm headed through our area, things could get worse before they get better. Tis the season. Oh, I just want to get there. You sort of, it doesn't get worse. For holiday weather delays. We'll get there eventually. Thousands of passengers heading home tonight are showing up to find this. Severe weather delays and cancellations. So you're here anxiously waiting to see if it's a go. Yeah, basically. Passengers like Noah Sloshberg. His flight to Chicago has already been delayed twice tonight. The New York City native has a midterm exam in the morning. The professor said, oh, you can't, if you missed a midterm, you know, you're out of luck. So hopefully I can get back tonight, study a bunch, and then take my midterm tomorrow. But it looks like my flight can make, keep getting, you know, pushed back and back, and then, you know, I'm just out of luck. Some passengers are experiencing up to two-hour delays at all area airports. Many people are just trying to get back home and back to work after a long Thanksgiving weekend. Freezing rain is a different story, so that's where we, when we saw that uh, windshield being hit by, uh, by freezing rain, like, uh oh, <laughs> well, yeah, we need to get early. And other travelers are just happy to touch down when they did. We could see it snowing when we landed, and we had turbulence coming in. They said we were just missing the storm, so I feel lucky that we got out in time. It's a stressful end to a long weekend for many travelers, but for some far away visitors, their winter holiday is just getting started. The idea of waking up to a beautiful white vista is just magical. I can't wait. And coming from Australia, Australia, you'll look forward to that. Obviously, we don't see snow so much. <laughs> um, so I can't wait. There is a first time for everything. And back out here live, we're seeing delays here ranging anywhere between 15 minutes to one hour. A similar situation at JFK. But at Newark, passengers are having to wait a little longer. In some cases, up to two hours. So if you're heading out tonight or picking someone up from the airport, you want to check those flight times first.